Oh, okay. Shit. Dude, lady, hold on, hold on. Wait up, wait up, wait up. Your grace seems right at home in a saddle. <laughs> I like this girl a lot. It's her grace. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd you go? There you are. Okay. Dude, this um, place is beautiful, by the way. Gorgeous castle. Okay, where are we going? Slower. It's here, just round the corner. Okay. Hurry. Let's go. We must go to where the game is being held. The participants must find a unicorn's horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. I mean we need to find those things too? <laughs> We've no other option, but time is of the essence, so we shall have to break the rules. <laughs> What are we gonna do? On second thought, through here. Oh, change the weather. <laughs> I shall show you where the hunt plays out. Then we will split up. You will get hold of the unicorn horn and the golden fish. While I nab the phoenix egg. That will be quickest. Unicorn horn? The unicorn. How do I catch it? It's terribly skittish, true, but I'm sure you will find a way to earn its trust. Axie. <laughs> it runs around over there, look. Axie. Golden fish. Do I need a rod or a net? Please, Gareth. It's not a real fish. Look there, towards the water. See the lights? The hunters are trying to hook the fish from boats. You must simply dive in and find it. Okay. The golden fish and the horn both contain things or clues that will help us find Milton. Once you have fish and horn, find me among the other Phoenix egg hunters. All clear? Then let's get to it. Ah, oh, very little time. Okay. That's fine. So I will do the unicorn first gonna get my axi ready because I'm gonna use that come through come through not much time Fiorano of the 1290 vintage I'm cutting through here there we go all right I think axi is the best way to go here for the uh, the actual unicorn it's the only way I'm actually gonna calm this thing Yeah, there he is. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Yennefer would like this. Perhaps an apple will work, or some sweets. We would not be in this predicament, dear sister. Were you still a virgin? What? Do you really wish to have this conversation again, here and now? Hush, or you'll spook the beast. We shall try the sweets. Hey, folks. Gonna have to ruin your fun. Sorry. Who's that? Easy. Easy, boy. Easy. 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 Ah, oh, crap. There we go. Axie, Geralt. Axie. Use your witcher senses to find a treat. Okay. Here we go. What's this? Think unicorns. Rainbows, little girls. <laughs> sweets, maybe. You can really it. prepare it by using basically it in an appropriate slot in the inventory panel, then select it from quick access. Thief! How dare he! Scandalous! Hold on! Where's he at? Where'd it go? There it is. I don't know if this is going to work. Take the cookie to the unicorn and gain its trust. Okay. Damn, it doesn't have a sweet tooth. Nope, okay. That's fine. That's fine. 
furniture. How do I put it away? There we go. Just drop it. Oh, what's this? Perhaps we should try to hook the Cold game's not shorts. likely to tempt a unicorn. Okay, what's this? Crispy apple. Apple. Might, Might work. Like other damn horse. Might work. Okay, I wish Geralt could run quicker. <laughs> He's walking slowly. An apple. Yum yum. Yeah, tasty apple. There we go. There we are, boy. <laughs> it's always the apples. You should know this. Roach as well. Go juicy apple for you. Now give me the one. Good boy. There we go. Gardens are huge. Be better off on horseback. Yeah, I'm riding the unicorn. <laughs> go. Giddy up. There we go. Put it under Axie just to calm him down. Spot once I'm under. Faster. Okay, let's uh, get off the unicorn here. Right, here we go. What the blazes? Yep. Did someone just dive in the mm -hmm. water? Perhaps that's the way to do it. <laughs> sure, if you're a peasant. No time for this, dudes. That's a normal fish. I see something sparkling. What's that? Oh, that looks golden to me. Right there. There you go. That looks golden. There it is. Got it. Yeah. Geralt's the party game. Tournament king. There it is. Oh, no. That's my goldfish. Hey, wait. Stop. It's important. King Cormorant, Sire, accept this offering we bring. Prithee, cast upon us your merciful eye and bear before us its secrets. Uh. As the moon its heavenly course doth trace, in my domain I await that moment of grace when a soul of good or ill repute brings me a gift, fitting tribute. <laughs> Uh, a a key. key. Meet the Duchess. Why, you bomb-botched wretch! He's ruined the game! Disgraceful! Oh, good, chill. Alright, let's go back and get on my unicorn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my god, it's already dark. Holy crap. Oh, this is so beautiful. I love it. Love is cold. Wow. Can't see where I'm going. Here we go. All right, okay. There it is. There it is. Let's go. Go, go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I have to say, how gorgeous is this? Dude, hey guys, check this out. Incredible. Okay, <laughs> I better stop her admiring it and get to save my friend. Ow! Out of the way. Come through. Whoa. Yeah, here we go. If you please, Your Grace. We do not please. We act out of the highest necessity. All shall be explained later. 
but it's against the rules. I am the rules. Geralt, at last. Got a key and a clue. And I've another. Show me yours. Who wrote this drivel? I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, and end like a mouse with a head hard of cheese. Hmm. It's hard, man. Hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. Pantry? Mice and cheese. Palace pantry, maybe? No. The hare is obliged to hide here in the gardens. Mm. Look, if we take grow, hollow it out and fill it with ease. The letters, that is. We get green. green. Then mouse, but starting with what heads heart cheese. Greenhouse. Why, it's greenhouse. Hi, it's very oh, clever. Pretty clever. And it sounds right to me. There are several greenhouses in the gardens, but only one with a door that locks, and the key to it looks just like the one we found. Greenhouse it is then. Let's go. Like she likes to wait. <gasps> it's already been. It's already there. Oh shit, it's already killed him. Crap. Get to it, Gerald. Oh, what the, what the hell? It's a vampire of some kind. Oh, that is a useful skill. Go Geralt. <laughs> he is good. I'm here. This belonged to you, maybe? It did, but you may keep it. I've a new one. I do not know you. I've done you no harm. Yet first you butchered a Bruxer who was dear to me. Now you pursue me. Why? You've killed four innocent people, at least. And you? How many innocents have you cut down? Many. Plenty. Even more of the guilty, though. You're next. Hmm. I think not. You see, I've something to do still. More murders? Just one. <sighs> not counting yours. Oh, crap. <gasps> Damn, this guy means business. Holy crap. Okay. I, I won't let you kill again. Oh, this guy's hard. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Dude, that is not working. Okay. That works. Oh, just nothing. Okay, I don't want to die. 
I don't want to die. I don't want to die. This is doing nothing to him. This is not the time for my silver sword to be not working. Blocking. Get out of it. God. Jesus. Okay. This guy's hard. Oh, oh missed him. Dodged him. Dodged him. I dodged him. Oh my god! Quinn! Yeah. 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 Yerdin did nothing, man. Above you. Above you. <gasps> you were to stay where you were. Regenerate. I know you're in trouble. I can help. I'll help myself. No, he's my friend. I'm so confused. What the hell? Yes, Geralt, it's me. Regis? I... You all right? All is well. All's in order. Wounds such as these heal on vampires in moments. But we've not seen one another in ages, my friend. At least in human terms, that is. How's this even possible? Last I saw you, we... I was a bubbling, shapeless smear, having been rather spectacularly melted into a column of a certain castle. In somewhat better shape now, as you can see. Hardly peak four, mind you, but were I human, folk would think me a demigod, I dare say. <laughs> I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. Never got a chance to apologize. No need, Geralt. Bygones. I did not have to join you on that expedition. No one twisted my arm. Miraculous regeneration. How do you manage it? I had help. From the one you hunt. Him? How? And what have you been doing all these years? Not the time nor place for such stories. I suspect we'll get a chance to speak at ease and at length later. Now. However, we must deal with the reason that brought us both here. <laughs> Local serial killer seems to obey you. Maybe you could talk him out of it, convince him to stop murdering. Why do you think I'd come? It shall not be easy, as death laugh can be rather stubborn. Though you must certainly recall that neither do I surrender readily. So that's his name. He's your friend? You might call it that. Though Detlaf is, how would you humans put it, more bestial than I am. But not to worry. I'm working on him. Haven't exactly done a great job with that. He's killed one night since I got here, at least three others before I arrived. For good reason, I'm sure. 
Understand, Detlaf is not some decadent shit who kills for sport, or to assuage a dryness of throat or a dullness of mood. So in your opinion, what are his reasons? Precisely what I wish to find out. And then I will convince him of the error of his ways. Got a lot of faith in the guy. Despite appearances to the contrary, you two are quite alike. You've both noble hearts, yet you both are wont to perform ignoble deeds. When circumstances force you to, of course. Remember the year 964? That was three centuries ago. Blind fear gripped Rivia, Lyria, and Spala. Women and children were dying. Their mutilated, dismembered corpses littered the fields. Brute of Lyria. Read about it. Chewed up almost two hundred, then fell to a common poacher supposedly armed with a dagger blessed by some prophet. It fell to Detlaf, who then found a poacher asleep in the brush near his snares and dropped the fiend's corpse at his feet. And thus, a legend was born. Huh. Vampires rarely help humans. Must have had his own agenda hunting the beast. You err. He slew it for one reason alone. The monster killed a lad who once in the street had offered Detlaf an apple, expecting nothing in return. Terribly noble of him. You do not have a monopoly on altruism, my friend. Mm -hmm. Vilgefort melted my body. Detlaf found what was left. As per our codex, he had a choice. To leave me where I was, or to care for me and nurture my remains. He chose the latter, regenerated me at no small expense in his own blood. Do you know what that means to a vampire? The gravity of the endeavor? Probably same thing it means to a human. You owe him your life. Much more than that. The act itself made us blood brethren. A bond so strong humans cannot even imagine. Which is why I know something ill is afoot. Always had an overdeveloped sense of empathy. Each vampire has a unique talent, one they hone over centuries. It's precisely what renders us so difficult to classify. Detlaf's trump card is his herd instinct, his tribal propensity. In point of fact, he prefers the company of lesser vampires and shuns that of humans. If he walks among you, killing egregiously, it can only mean something's upset him immensely. Hmm. Anything specific? Some set of things that'd be likely to set him off? How should I say this? Detlaf doesn't understand men, their world, its rules, its conventions. He's naive in a sense. He doesn't comprehend your games, knows not what it means to lie, deceive. Huh. Suggesting he's maladjusted, inventing his rage. I'm suggesting maladjustment can at times breed conflict. But is it the case this time? I cannot say but intend to find out. Gotta find him before something upsets him even more and all Beau Claire is awash with blood. Well, we share a cause then, just like the old days. Not entirely. I mean, when I find him, you know. I know you've a contract on his head. Yet your true task is to stop the beast killing, not necessarily to kill the beast, am I right? All in all, sure. Let us find him. By the time we do, I hope I'll have convinced you Detlaf is no monster. Fine, all right already. But for now, evidence is stacking up against him. Hear that? The posse. Knights must have tracked me here. I prefer they not find me here. I'd make shift quarters at Mer Lachaise Long Cemetery. We'll meet there. See you. We flew here as fast as our courses would carry us. Yet I fear we're late all the same. Pray, where is the beast? Still investigating. About to inspect this site. Withdraw your men before they trample all over the evidence. <clears throat> Sirs, we must let the Witcher do his work. Milton's murder cannot go unoffensed. Okay. Right, that's fine. So we're going to actually uh, meet him there. That's fine. 
Okay guys, so I'm going to have to finish here for now, I'm afraid. Um, I can't record anymore, so I'm going to finish. Uh, I am going away this weekend, which means I won't be able to play this weekend, but I will be back. I'm planning, I've got Monday off work, so I'm planning to play a lot of the Witcher 3 Blood and Wine DLC. So I'll be back on Monday playing more and obviously recording more. Anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying this playthrough so far. I'm really enjoying it. The new monsters have been great. The story is very intriguing. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to find out more of what's going to happen. All right, guys and girls, we'll take care. And as always, happy gaming. Yeah. Easy. 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 Ah, oh, crap. There we go. Axie, Geralt. Axie. Use your Witcher senses to find a treat. Okay. Here we go. What's this? Thank you, unicorns. Rainbows, little girls, <laughs> sweets, maybe. You can really quickly prepare it by using by using it in an appropriate slot in the inventory panel, then select it from quick access. Thief! How dare he! Scandalous! Hold on! Where's he at? Where'd it go? Hey. Golden fish. Do I need a rod or a net? Please, Garrett. It's not a real fish. Look there, <laughs> towards the water. See the lights? The hunters are trying to hook the fish from boats. You must simply dive in and find it. Okay. The golden fish and the horn both contain things or clues that will help us find Milton. Once you have fish and horn, find me among the other Phoenix egg hunters. All clear? Then let's get to it. Ah, oh, very little time. Okay. That's fine. So I will do the unicorn first. Gonna get my axe ready. Because I'm going to use that. Come through. Come through. Not much time. Fiorano of the 1290 vintage. I do encourage you to try. I'm cutting through here. There we go. Right. Oh. Okay. Shit. Dude, lady. Hold on. Hold on. Wait up. Wait up. Wait up. Your grace seems right at home in a saddle. <laughs> I like this girl a lot. It's her grace. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd you go? There you are. Okay. Dude, this um, place is beautiful, by the way. Gorgeous castle. Okay, where are we going? Slower. It's here, just round the corner. Okay. Hurry. Let's go. We must go to where the game is being held. The participants must find a unicorn's horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. I mean we need to find those things too? <laughs> We've no other option, but time is of the essence, so we shall have to break the rules. <laughs> what are we gonna do? On second thought, through here. Oh, change the weather. <laughs> I shall show you where the hunt plays out. Then we will split up. You will get hold of the unicorn horn and the golden fish. While I nap the phoenix egg. That will be quickest. Unicorn horn? The unicorn. How do I catch it? It's terribly skittish, true, but I'm sure you will find a way to earn its trust. Axie. <laughs> Axie. Right, I think Axie is the best way to go here for the uh, the actual unicorn. It's the only way I'm actually going to calm this thing. Right, it's this way. Okay, where is he at? There he is. Okay, here we go. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Yennefer would like this. Perhaps an apple will work. Or some sweets. We would not be in this predicament, dear sister. Were you still a virgin? What? Do you really wish to have this conversation again? Here and now? Hush, or you'll spook the beast. We shall try the sweets. Hey, folks. Gonna have to ruin your fun. Sorry. Who's that? 